Hello folks, we're moving on to 7.2, which is division as repeated subtraction. This might be a new concept for parents, so buckle in, and I think we can get through it pretty easily. So this problem says, Emily has 20 raffle tickets. There are five tickets in each book. How many books of raffle tickets does Emily have? So when we're using repeated subtraction, I'm going to go ahead and just write the problem over here. 20 divided by 5 equals what? Okay. When we're doing repeated subtraction, it's just like repeated addition and multiplication. So if I'm doing 2 times 3, I can do 2 groups of 3, which would be 3 plus 3 equals 6. Or if it's 3 groups of 2, 2 plus 2 plus 2 equals 6. Same thing happens for division. 20 divided by 5, I'm going to subtract 5 until I get to 0. So we can see that here. 20 minus 5 is 15. 15 minus 5 equals 10, 10 minus 5 equals 5, and 5 minus 5 equals 0. <clears throat> now you take the number that you're subtracting is always this first number, and then my answer is going to be how many times I had to do it to get to 0. So there's 1, 2, 3, 4. Since I had to subtract 5 4 times, my answer for this problem would be 4. So 20 divided by 5 equals 4. Now number one, and we're going to use repeated subtraction again. Ten markers, five markers in a box. How many boxes? So that's going to be ten divided by five equals what? So I'm going to subtract five from ten as many times as it takes to get to zero. So ten minus five equals five. And then five minus five equals zero. So the number that I'm subtracting is 5, and then I'm going to count how many times it took to get to 0. 1 time, 2 time. So 10 divided by 5 takes me 2 times to get to 0. Same thing for number 2. 8 hamsters, 2 hamsters in each cage. How many cages? That's going to be 8 divided by 2 equals how many? So I'm going to start with 8 and subtract 2. That equals 6. Got to keep going. 6 minus 2 equals 4. Keep going. 4 minus 2 equals 2. 2 minus 2 equals 0. I'm at 0. 2 is the number that I'm subtracting. How many times do I have to do it? 1, 2, 3, 4. So the answer is 4 cages. One more with you. 16 books. Four books on each shelf. How many shelves? I'm going to start with 16. Subtract 4. That equals 12. 12 minus 4 equals 8. 8 minus 4 equals 4. And finally, 4 minus 4 equals 0. 16 is my total amount of books. Divided by 4 books on a shelf equals what? Let's count how many times we subtracted. 1. 2, 3, 4, so 16 divided by 4 equals 4.